Easier with these special shoes called crampons. Yeah, the claws on the bottom of these shoes can really dig in. Whoa, look at these amazing claws. Lobster claws. They're even bigger than my crampons. Wow. Look at that tail flick. It zooms her through the water. Zabu's gonna love to see this. Let's call him. There you go, buddy. Zabu! 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 Zabu Mafu! Here comes that leaping lemur. Hey, hey Zabu! Zabu. <laughs> so, buddy, you want to scratch? <laughs> there you go. Hang on. Let's see what the snack machine has for Zabu today. Walnuts! I'll need a little help with this one. If I had claws like a lobster, I wouldn't need this. Sabu, I've got a nut. Want a tap? There you go. Atta boy. <laughs> Look at Sabu's feet. You can see his toenails. You don't want it anymore? Give me some of the food! Hey, brothers, what's this? It's a pinata. Huh? There's a lot of cool stuff inside. Stuff that's always a surprise. Huh? The trick with the pinata is busting in to see what's inside. Everybody knows that busting into a pinata on your birthday is a lot of fun, full of surprises. I gotta see what's inside. <laughs> okay. I don't think my hands can break in the <laughs> piñata. Oh, oh, oh. oh! I meant to do that. <laughs> he might figure it out with a little help from his animal friends. Well, who's that? My mind can't believe what it's seeing. She's the biggest, clawiest water bug I've ever seen. That's a lobster, Zabu. Oh. She's a crustacean, which means she has her skeleton on the outside of her body. Crustacean. Oh. Lobsters and crabs are crustaceans with claws. Wow, I love crustaceans. <gasps> oh. Ah, ah, oh, oh. What happens, huh? Oh, oh. Are you okay? Oh, oh yeah. Look, I can't believe my mind. Lobster got me with his super claw. Oh. Hey, I want some of those. <laughs> What's some of what? Super claws. How about it, Martin? Why not? All right, let's see. Gotta have serrated grips. Plus, we gotta position the joint for maximum Mine power. Zika. Yeah! Right. <laughs> Whoa, I love claws! Yeah, huh? these are super claws with special lobster features. Whoa, claws, just like the lobster. Ready or not, piñata, here I come. Super claws will help. I'll try my lobster claws to get inside the piñata. It, it's not working. <sighs> well, they're good for grabbing, but not for getting inside a piñata. Hey, I saw a creature with claws on my way here. Who could she be? Who could it be? <laughs> this animal who I did see. Can you help me guess this mystery? She had a 
long tail that could grab things like branches. A wraparound hanging tail. <laughs> Four paws for climbing, and those paws had claws! Can you help me guess this mystery? A super clawed tree loving creature. Do you know who she is? Alright, let's review. Long climbing claws, grabby tail, big eyes. I know who the mystery animal is. Do you? A kinkajou! Kratz cracked the animal mystery again. It's a kinkajou! <laughs> Yay, the mystery animal is here. He's... Incredible! Whoa, what an amazing climber. Tail, paws, and claws. <laughs> climbing claws, huh? Yeah, and climbing claws are sharp and curved for a good grip. <laughs> hey, you want to go climb around some more? All right, let's go. Me too. Mm -hmm. What a great climber. Hey, wait for me. Kinkajous can really climb. Yeah, kinkajous have great climbing claws that really grip into the tree branch. She likes trees like me. She sure does. A kinkajou spends most of her time in trees, so she needs special climbing power. Her long, sharp claws on her front and back paws dig in and help her get around. She's a super clawed creature. Super claws, huh? Well, I have leaping lemur claws. Well, nails, actually, I guess. My mind just got a great idea. Chris, I need some help in the claws department because my claws are, well, kind of boring. I need some climbing claws. You got it, buddy. Huh? <laughs> Yes, climbing claws. Here's a challenge. All right. So we need a lot of sharp points. Yeah. And gotta get clean power here. Chris, watch out for the roll. Whoa! Oh, oh, sorry, Zob. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, now back to the clean power. Gotta get the curve in these claws so they grab on right. King yeah. yeah. you super claws. What do you wow. think of them, Zabu? They're Manga Zika. Let's try them out. Yeah. yeah, now I'm Zabu the super claw. <laughs> 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 uh -oh. <laughs> wow, look at this prehensile tail in action. Did you see how he grabs his tail to pull himself up? He uses it like a rope. A kinkajou is great at hanging upside down, and she's not the only one. A flying fox hangs from his curved super claws all day long, until he flies off at night. A bat can fly with his claws. I can't even get up. I gotta, yeah. Oh, finally. These are Mungatsika Super Claws. Now I'm Zabu Super Claw. <laughs> Pinata, here I come with my new claws. <sighs> Kinkajou Claws. These will get inside this Pinata. <laughs> They're yep. claws for tearing and defending. Yep. yep. Okay, she'll stand up yep. like that to defend herself with those sharp claws. Another amazing use for those claws. It's Super Claw Defense, and Bobcats do it too. <laughs> Well, they're not so good for getting inside the piñata. Oh! Not again. Almost. Okay. Yeah. Oh, phew, that's better. Excuse me, Kinkajou. Wait a second. You're not a Kinkajou. You're a sloth. I know you. You're slow high. <laughs> hey, I know you too. Hi, slower. Slow and slower are here. I'm surrounded by super claws. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, I need more push ups. Yeah. With muscles, the bear cub. Hey, check out slower. Amazing. This is incredibly rare. Sloths hardly ever come down to the ground. They only come down to the ground when they have to go to the bathroom. Excuse me. I think Slow wants to be alone when he poops. There we go. Go ahead, slower. A sloth hangs out in trees, and I mean really hangs. See that? 
His claws hook over a tree branch, and his body hangs down. His feet and toes are hidden in his fur. You can only see his long, curved, pointed claws as he very slowly makes his way along the branches. A sloth moves less than 125 feet in a whole day. You can walk that far in 30 seconds. Wow, what super claws? Their curved claws are kind of like coat hangers. Perfectly designed for hooking onto and hanging from branches. And a piece of bark, sloth claws can hold onto anything. And kinkajou claws are great for holding fruit. Now we have two super clawed upside down creatures in Animal Junction. Hey brothers, look! Slower's having an upside down nap. Wow, they can sleep hanging upside down. But how do they do it? I, my hands are tired all uh, already. Oh. Whoa, here's how you do it, Zob. Want to see if Chris is perfectly designed for hanging upside down? Oh. <laughs> Zob, <laughs> Zob, <laughs> Zob, <laughs> Zob. <laughs> Zob. <laughs> I guess not. Cracks don't have super claws either. Here you go. I've tried lobster claws and I've tried kinkajou claws, but sloths have super claws too. So you know what, Martin? Now I need some hanging upside down claws so I can hang with my sloth buddies. <laughs> I'm all over it, Zabu. Well, you're making my super claws even better. I'll tell you a story about one time in Zabu land. I was <laughs> leaping along. Leap, leap, leap. Leap when I leaped right into Bugly. Whoa, 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 coming down. Whoa. Hey now, what's happened there, Zabu? How'd you get so high in the sky? I told Bugly that I was power leaping on my super <laughs> lemur legs. If you got them, use them. That's what I say. If it's fun, do it again and do it right away. Come on. Okay. <laughs> whoa. Whoa. Oof. Whoa. whoa. We fell into a coconut bush. Oh. And everyone knows how yummy coconuts are. Well, we wanted to eat some but we couldn't open them. All of a sudden, I felt huh? something, and then this funny blob with eyes floated up to say hello. It was Phoebe and all her crazy legs. Hello. Oh, hi, Phoebe. Hey, Phoebe. Hi, <laughs> Want me to crack your mocha oh, thanks, hey, Phoebe. Good idea. Oh, oh thanks. Oh. So, Bugly and Ark <laughs> ate Bokanuts all day long. The end. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so we've added the hanging hooking claws to the huh? climbing claws to make the new super claws. Think I better super claws? Here I come. Am I doing it right? He's got the arm over arm. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm getting the hang of it. Hey, yep. you're a natural hanging climber. Yep. Go you're climbing yep. just like the sloths. Pretty good. Wow. These hanging upside down climbing claws are manga tzika. I'm feeling super clawish. <laughs> I feel different, not the same. Well, this kind of feeling I can't explain. There's only one thing that I can do. I feel super clawish. How about you, super clawish? I feel super clawish. Super clawish. I'm a long clawed claw and I can do it all. <laughs> okay, piñata. Oh, these claws must be great for breaking piñatas. I've got to see what the surprise is inside. The claws work. Oh, we're free! Yeah, oh, last. I could have drilled them. I did it. I finally did it. Well, Zob, you found out what was inside. Way to go! Yay! It's the Zobu Land characters. I didn't even know they were hiding inside. <laughs> Surprise, surprise, surprise! Well, Zob, you found the right claws for the job. Yeah, sloth claws aren't really meant for ripping and tearing, but they did the trick. All creature claws can do special things. They do what the creature needs to survive. Whether you're a koala climbing up eucalyptus trees, or a black bear cub escaping from danger, a Harris hawk sitting on a branch, a praying mantis grabbing prey, 
a tamandua a digging for termites and rotten wood. Or an eye eye poking for insects. All creature claws are super claws, built especially for them. Super claw! Right, <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look! The kinkajou and the sloth are climbing up in the beams. Hang on, super clawed buddies. Here I come. Yeah. Well, this isn't so bad. These are gonna work fine. Uh, yeah. uh, uh oh, I can't hold. Oh! 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 Itching powder. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> She's back! Oh, never fear. I'll help you guys with my super claws. Oh, no. Not the super claw. No, anything but the super claw. Here I come. No! Sabu. Huh? Our shirts. Uh-oh. Maybe I should have used my lemur tooth comb. I think my super claws are a little bit too clawy. Uh, brothers, could you? All right. Mm -hmm. oh, thanks. And you know what, brothers? My mind decided that kinkajou claws are for kinkajous and sloth claws are for sloths. Everybody has their own claws for a good reason. That's what we've been telling you. Me, I'm happy with my leaping lemur nails. They may not be super claws, but they work okay for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, Zabu sure knows about claws. And so do you. Incoming! Duck! <laughs> It's Sticky Feet, the Peregrine Falcon. I can't believe his super claws. Yeah, <laughs> these super claws are amazing. They're grabbing claws, perfect for catching birds in midair. Let's see what the animal helpers are up to today. Hi, guys. Hi, Zabu. My cat Myrtle loves scratching the furniture. The problem is my mom doesn't really love it. So how do I get Myrtle to stop scratching the furniture? Easy. Make a scratching post. A scratching post is made of some wood, carpet, and anything else that Myrtle might like to scratch. Get your mom or dad to help you. Just glue the pieces together, staple on the carpet, ta-da! Now Myrtle can scratch all she wants, and everyone's happy! Aren't we, Myrtle? There are all sorts of super clawed creatures. Let's check them out! They're going to the closet, they're going on a trip. They're going to the closet to grab their stuff and split. <laughs> They're going on a cool adventure and they don't know what's in store. They're coming from the closet and they're headed out the door. To the creatures! Buy some boom of food! Buy's up! Hi, brothers! Out here in the African wilderness, super claws really come in handy. All around us, creatures are using their nails and claws on their hands and paws for survival. Just have a look around. Check out the mongoose claws. And the meerkat's long, skinny claws. Wahlberg eagle claws are talent. Praying mantis claws. Chameleon claws. Crocodile claws. And cheetah claws, which don't retract, by the way. One of the greatest super claws in Africa is the lion. Lions use their claws to hunt prey, like wildebeest. When they feel like it. And they also use them to steal food from other predators. Like Martin. Nice try, Chris. I guess this might happen to a lion going after a porcupine. <laughs> I know how to protect my snacks. <laughs> Doesn't hurt that much. Hey, super clawed mongoose diggers. Diggers have to have super claws because there's a lot of good food underground that they can get at. Look at those mongoose go. A mongoose is one of the best diggers around. Look at everybody digging out here. A mongoose stands with legs apart, shoveling the dirt behind him, and he's fast. 
That goes for meerkats too, another kind of mongoose. As soon as he finds a nice juicy millipede, snack time. Oh. Ah, you know, I think mongoose are better diggers than I am. Ouch. You know, it doesn't hurt too much, just a flesh wound. How you doing, Chris? I'm fine now. <laughs> All right. Oh. Chris, a leopard! Awesome. A leopard is a major super clawed creature. To the trees! Let's put what's left of our claws to leopard climbing. The super claws of the leopard make him a great climber. And climbing is essential for a leopard's survival in the African wilderness. Martin, the leopard, he spotted us. Uh -oh. I don't think he wants us in the same tree. Time to bail out. Now we're gonna have to clear that acacia, but those thorns are as sharp as claws. You think we can? We have to. I thought for sure we'd clear that acacia. Oh, so did I. Ah, you know, these acacia thorns, they don't just hurt, they kind of itch too. Hey, we're not the only ones scratching. Look at those super claws go. Looks like all creatures are itchy in Africa today, and they all have their own special claws to scratch with. You know, Chris, we really have to work over our leap over a tree and over an acacia bush. I know. Back to the jungle. I wonder what Zabu's up to. Let's find out. Tigers! Hey, we know you guys. Popper, pop up. Great to see you again. And I see you're after the balls as usual. Those claws, the balls don't stand a chance. Maybe this time I can stop them. Hey guys, uh, you want to leap with me instead of popping all the balls again? Uh, guess not. One of the most incredible things about a tiger is his super claws. And they practice with them. Oh no, there goes another one. Tigers have amazing retractable claws from the time they're cubs. And they practice them, retracting them and scratching to keep them sharp. Look how she can use her claws to grab even a small branch. Amazing. Hey, Popper, you want to play? Yeah. Popper's practicing using her claws, because when she grows up, she'll use them to hunt. <laughs> Another thing a tiger uses his claws for is marking his territory. The scratches in this tree mean, hey, this is my space. Check out the super claw face spot. <laughs> Whoa. All of these Mungetsika super clawed creatures remind me of one time in Sabu Land. <laughs> I was leaping along, leap, 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 and I landed next to Snow Lemur. Well, he was playing in the sand. <laughs> Hi, Snow Lemur, I said. Hi, Sabu. I really like playing in the sand. It feels good, yeah. Oh, it's I like good. sand too. Huh? It tickles my fingers. <laughs> oh, yeah, mine too, yeah. And sand tickles my sides too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah! It tickles my sides, too! <laughs> it tickles. Oh, it tickles. <laughs> oh, it tickles. <laughs> hey, wait a second! What's going on? Sand can't tickle your sides! Oh, you're right, Zabu. It's me, Phoebe! Hi, Phoebe! I'm the one who's tickling you with my tentacle and big claws! <laughs> oh, did you like this? Have you tried my swim through my super claw game? Oh, uh, play in warm water? No thanks. Uh, nah. Oh, wait for me, Fibby. I want to play your water game. What is Zabu? Honey, let's play swim through my super clog. Yeah. Hey, Slime Asa, hey. come and play with us. Oh, thanks, Zabu. I'd love to play. Oh, hey, Fibby's on the slippery like <laughs> mine. She come underwater with me okay. and we'll play. <laughs> Here I go. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> And so we did. Fibby opened her big claws, and Slimantha and I swam through them. We jumped off Fibby's long arms and swam through her claws all afternoon. 
Bibby is my underwater super clawed friend. <laughs> the end. Great story, Sal. Well, thanks. This animal is a friend of mine. From the tip of his nose to his body behind. All the friends that we met today are special in their own way. We've all got different names, but we're really all the same. Thanks for dropping by. We're glad you came. Super Claws. These animals are friends of mine. They jump and swim, crawl, fly, and climb. One more thing we have to say. Go make an animal friend today. I guess I better leave home. Bye, brothers. See you later, Zabu. Bye, Zab. Hey, Chris, you know, have we ever seen the reptile with the longest claws? The Komodo dragon. Let's go. We'll see you next time. Bye. My name is Beatrice, and this is my cat, Muffin.